All right, adding a few more notches to the fake racist hate crimes we have here. A man who drew swastikas across Nassau Community College has now been arrested. He's probably a white supremacist, right? Well, actually, no. It's this guy, a Plainview man who was arrested Tuesday and charged with drawing hateful graffiti on the Community College campus in East Garden City on multiple different occasions. According to authorities, Jaskarat Saini, 20 of Central Park Road, was arrested at 12.38 p.m. for multiple bias incidences. Okay, so police had been responding to the campus for instances of swastikas drawn on buildings since October. Most of the swastikas were found drawn in men's bathrooms in the various buildings around campus. So another fake racist hate crime. Also this week, the University of Michigan had a student's claim of threat for wearing a hijab was actually proven to be false. So an Ann Arbor police say there is no evidence to support a Muslim University of Michigan student's claim that a man threatened to light her on fire if she didn't remove her hijab. Now, the woman who isn't being identified could be charged with filing a false police report, according to police. Detective Lieutenant Matthew Ligge said the final police report will be sent to the Washtenaw County Prosecutor's Office for review early next week. So yet another fake racist hate crime. And the third and final one of the day to add to the list was a burning of a Mississippi black church. And before we look into that, let's just take a look at the Young Turks on November 2nd who were reporting on this. Black uh, church in Mississippi was set on fire. That's the Hopewell Missionary Baptist Church. It was early today, and in addition to being set on fire, it also had Vote Trump spray painted on it in big letters. So there well, it could be a Democrat. It could be a liberal. You don't know. Could be you don't know. Could be black lives. So they, of course, are wrong again because this guy apparently wasn't a white supremacist who burnt down the church and wrote Vote Trump on it was actually this guy who the Mississippi Department of Public Safety spokesman Warren Strain says Andrew McClinton of Leland, Mississippi, who is an African-American, is charged with first-degree arson of a place of worship. So yet another fake racist hate crime. Please, please, please look into this shit before you eat it up as truth.